Hello my friends, in this video I'm just gonna show you how to install a wall mount double pull thermostat, nice and easy. Let's open this guy up, a little bit stuck in there. We have the thermostat itself, we have the manual, two screws, we have the SATA piece that we can replace to cells because this one is in Fahrenheit. So I'm just gonna show you guys how to do that. Let's work. So first we're just gonna remove this guy up, recover it. Okay. The cover is there, just gonna put it aside and then once you look in here, because I need it on cells, so you see those clip in there, you just can uh, very much pop it out. There we go, and then we just get a pop this one in. You cannot go wrong because you see the set just fit one way, so all we do, like you guys can see, just gonna pop it right in. Now you can see the double pole, we have four wires and we have a instruction in here. Let's grab the instructions. This is the one that we're going to. If you have any doubt, just flip the thermostat over it, just the way it is in there. And then you just go beside it. Like you can see this one show two wires come from power. The way they show here, the two red wires. Sometimes they show one black and one uh, red going to power, but this time they just show, you can see the two red, one there, one there, and the other two go to, to the heater. Let's do it. Let's get this job done. Yeah, guys, so in my case in here, I know these two wires bring power. You can see they are one black and one white, but they are 220 volts, 12 gauge wire. So let's clean this guy up a bit. Very much I, I think the break off, but uh, been a few days, let's test it. So for the time, even though you know the break is off, yeah, good idea to test it. So, hey guys, let's check it, make sure, so power is off, power is off in there, let's work. This two here we know goes to the heater, right? We know power on it. Let's follow instruction, right? Show the two red is the one who connect to the power line, gonna do by hand. Make sure it is nice and tight in there. Now the time you pull it, just try to pull a bit and go. So instruction is instruction. That's all instruction, right? Show the two red from the thermostat come from the power line. So let's do it. And then again, we just try to make sure it is nice and tight. Then the two black goes to the heater. So. Like I said, I had some of the same company that instruct to put a red and a black, but this one is too red from the power line. We just stuck uh, everything in. Ground, we don't have a ground on this thermostat, so the ground is just on the back of the box in there. And now we have a few couple of small screws. By the way, guys, I'm just use the eye level. Okay, now we have it in, in there. Put the cover on. We have it in here. Let me turn on the brake and see how it works, right? Okay, just to test it, let's put it a little bit higher. Put it, put it degree, right? Yeah, guys, let's see. Oh, it's work, it's hot. Work, this one is work, I just gonna put the cover on and I have another one here because I have uh, two heat in this uh, in the same thermostat because here is just uh, kind of underneath the stairs and I just want to keep it warm oh yeah, work nice and this is just a, uh, it is a storage space and I just try to make this like a living space just to have a bed and stuff. My shower is there, so I just need some heat. Hey guys, my heater works. In this one, I just look down in the panel. It is on a 15 amp brakes for the heaters and uh, working great. Didn't see any problems so far. Yeah, guys, I like more this double pole thermostat than the single pole. And uh, it works very good. This one is a nice one. But I love you guys and see you guys on the next one.